Hey tennis fans, I'm Grace Carter and this is Tennis Now presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today and it ships today. Tennis champions are creators capable of shaping points like sculptors. And for the last 45 years, an artist armed with a camera has captured some true tennis masterpieces. Legendary photographer Melchior Di Giacomo has shot 46 consecutive U.S. Opens and the top tournaments all over the world. Mel is one of the best and most distinguished photographers in the game, and he may well be the only photographer ever to have his work displayed in the Museum of Modern Art, Time Magazine, Newsweek, Sports Illustrated, The New York Times, and Tennis Week Magazine. In 2015, Mel was inducted into the USTA Eastern Tennis Hall of Fame for his contributions to the sport. Now, he's collaborating with writer and historian Brooke Zelker on a new book titled Existential Tennis. It features some of his favorite photos from the past four decades, so we thought we'd give you a sneak peek. Mel says he really likes capturing raw emotion. He wants to fill the frame with passion. Shooting tennis, he says, is more than forehands and backhands. Mel looks for the personality of the individuals, the anger, the frustration, the angst, all the things that make them human beings rather than just an athletic spectacle. Mel says tennis is different because it's an individual sport and because the players don't wear masks, you can see their pain and you get to see their joy. You focus on the joy and the heartache of each individual, he goes on to say. In many ways, these players are in an existential environment and Mel says he wants to be a part of it with his lens. And players always welcomed him in. Mel has been a part of their world, invited to their parties, their workouts, as a guest and a friend. It gave him the rare opportunity to capture private and intimate moments. Bjorn Borg is one of tennis's most beloved champions, but did you know that he was actually a champion ping pong player before he ever took up tennis? Borg and his good friend Vitas Gerolaitis often practiced together at Vitas's Long Island home where the shot was taken. Mel says they fought as hard in those practices as they did in Grand Slam matches. The book Existential Tennis comes 40 years after Hall of Famer and Tennis Week magazine publisher Gene Scott and Mel collaborated on the groundbreaking book Tennis Game of Motion, which by the way is still available on Amazon. Can you name these two legendary Hall of Fame champions who appear in the book? Here's a hint, Rod Laver idolized one of them and the other went on to coach two of America's greatest champions after his own playing career. We're going to close now with one of the artist's favorite images. Take a look. Three legends of the game, John McEnroe, Jimmy Connors, and Bjorn Borg, shot in the locker room of a senior tour event in New York back in the early 1990s. For more existential tennis and Mel's work, check out his website. These images are true tennis treasures. Let us know your favorites in the comment section below. That's it for now, everybody. I'm Grace Carter. We'll see you next time here on Tennis Now.